हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स आई एम डॉक्टर परवीन मलेक वेलकम बैक टू पी एम नॉलेज हब टूडे आई विल टॉक अबाउट दी ऑब्जेक्टिव इन रिसर्च एंड इट्स इम्पॉर्टेंस सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी मोर टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड द रिसर्च टाइटल इंडिकेट्स दी अल्टीमेट गोल ऑफ द रिसर्च वॉट इज दिस गोल टू बी रियलाइज is guided by the objectives of the study the purpose of research is nothing but the subtitle of the research title by achieving the objectives one by one the researcher achieves the main goal of the research thus we can say that the title is a main question to be answered through research and the objectives are the sub questions of this question by answering sub questions the researcher moves closer to answering the main question what does it mean it means the answers to all the sub questions together answer the main question the objectives of the same research problem may vary from person to person from time to time and from place to place let us take a simple and practical example to understand this concept suppose the researcher wants to study the problems of working women living in hostels the objectives of the study for this can be like to study the emotional problems of working women living in hostels to study the economical problems of working women living in hostels to study the social problems of working women living in hostels to study the mental problems of working women living in hostels to study the hygiene related problems of working women living in hostels to study the problems of working women living in hostels with reference to the facilities available in the hostel some researchers may set the objectives for the same type of research like to compare the emotional problems of women living in hostels and working in government and non government organization to compare the financial problems of women living in hostels and working in government and non government organizations to compare the social problems of women living in hostels and working in government and non government organization to compare the mental problems of women living in hostels and working in government and non government organization to compare the hygiene related problems of women living in hostels and working in government and non government organization to compare the problems of women living in hostels and working in government and non government organization on the basis of facilities available in hostels here are two ways to set objectives but the fact is that each objective looks like a part of the main title of the research problem some researchers may work to achieve all the above objectives some may take more variables for such study like age length of hostel stay marital status socio economic status etc in this way objectives are fixed according to need time expenditure and capacity of the researcher researcher has to take special care when determining the objectives of the research things to be keep in mind while writing research objectives some points should be kept in mind while making decisions to make the research objectives concrete and clearly realizable each objective should be based on directly related to the research problem the research problem should be defined properly and in simple language be sure to get data in respect of each objective it should be possible to analyze the data collected for each purpose objectives should be such that they can be accomplished within the specified time period all objectives together should be helpful in achieving the ultimate goal of research the number of objectives should not be too small to limit the scope of research and the number of objective should not be too large to make the research process more complicated a large number of objectives can confuse the researcher all the variables of the research should be reflected in the objective objectives should be such that they can lead the research process in the right direction objectives should be decided on the basis of individual expenditure in research or with the help of expert or on the basis of review of theoretical or research literature or on the basis of review of previous researches importance of objectives in research objectives provide direction to research activities they divide the main research question into sub questions 
so the researcher can focus properly to answer each question by following the proper steps. Objectives enable the researcher to plan research activities with precision and accuracy. Objectives explain the variable of the study. Objectives guide the researcher to select or develop research equipment or instrument for the study. Objectives help define the study population. They give the idea of selecting the proper technique for the analysis of the data. Objectives help in formulating hypotheses and developing research questions because each hypothesis and each question is clearly based on a certain objective of research. This means that each hypothesis or research question is directly related to a certain objective of the study. They help the researcher to expand the scope of research according to his capacity, need, and facilities available to him. Thank you very much for watching my video. Now we will discuss about hypothesis in the next lecture.